Hi guys, hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a new look haul. I feel like I haven't done a clothing haul for myself in quite a while, so this is very exciting. I'm loving new look at the moment. There's all sorts of bits and bobs in there that if I just go in to try and get one thing, I seem to pick up two or three things, which has happened on a few occasions, which is why I have quite a few things to show you. So we'll just get straight into it. I will show you them up here as best as I can and then I will show you them on as well. First up is this midi skirt that's going to be really hard to show you here because it's super long. So it's a pleated leopard print satiny kind of material midi skirt. It goes all the- I think it's even further than a midi skirt actually. It goes down to like kind of between my knees and my ankles and I love it. It's got a uh, elasticated waistband but at the front it's flat if you know what I mean. It's not got the sort of ruched elastic bit that's there which I think makes it a lot more flattering around your waist. I don't have much of a waist so when I wear things like this a lot of the time it goes in and it makes me look really like bumpy if it's not a very good waistband but this is lovely and it fits really well so really really loving it. Leopard print as well I find it's very hit or miss on whether it looks good or not but I love this print. And here it is on. I love this so much. I'm going to be able to wear it to work, date night, out with the girls, whatever. I really, really like it. It'll be really nice with flat boots or dressed up with heels. And I'm going to get loads of wear out of it. It was £22.99. To go with the skirt I just showed you, I also picked up this body. I haven't bought a lot of bodies in the past just because I think my like length of sort of here to here is quite long so sometimes I find them quite uncomfortable but this one seemed okay. Really like the plunge neck with the lace and then on the back it's got a strap there to kind of keep it up which is nice because there's nothing worse when things fold down. Not much else to say about it. It's slightly ribbed, I don't know if you can see and it's a nice, I wouldn't say properly thick material but it's a strong material if you know what I mean so I think it'll be quite flattering at keeping everything in. Here it is on, really like it, fits really nice, really comfy and I think I'll be able to wear it with quite a lot of things, not just skirts but also things like high-waisted jeans. And it was £17.99. On to another top which is quite hard to see the detail on camera, I'll show it up close and see if you can see it better but it's a really nice top that I thought would be really good for work, that's originally what I thought it would be good for. Then I thought actually it'd be quite nice with jeans and boots as well so yeah, really like it. Like the neckline, it's got the little detailing there but it sits in a nice place so I find if things are too high they get a bit choky but it's a nice and it's quite loose around your neck as well. So yeah, I don't know if you can see, but it, there's like a spotty detail. Let's try and get the light um, all the way through it. Oh, oh, maybe there, oh, slightly there. Can you see now? Just there, so that's really nice. And also, it's a really nice shape. Here it is on, it feels super flattering. It's nice and loose, so you could wear it out to dinner and eat as much as you want and be totally fine. And it was 15 99 Next up, another top, slightly brighter this time. It's a long sleeve red and white polka dot, but really mini polka dot top there with little cuffed sleeves and then a button detailing down the back there. I ended up getting this in a size bigger than I usually do. I usually get a 10, but I got it in a 12 because it felt a bit tight around the arms in the 10. It felt much better in the 12. Here it is on. I'm loving the brightness of it. Even in winter, there's something about red and I'm really enjoying it. And it was £12.99. Now onto some jeans. So I found this style of jean. They're called the um, Halley jean. Really, really comfortable and fit really well in the past. So I've ended up picking up another two pairs and some different washes. Completely different from any jeans I actually have, which is great. Much to Robert's delight as well, because he always says I buy the same jeans over and over again. But these are different. So yeah, these are the first ones. They, I got them both in a Tem and they do have a good stretch in them. So they're stretchy enough to be comfortable, but also fitted enough to not stretch out or go all saggy and baggy and whatever else. So yeah, really, really like this style of jean. Got them in this wash with the little ripped knees and then I also like the bottom of them. They're kind of just cut off rather than being hemmed or anything else. So yes, really like these. Here they are on, like I said, very, very, very comfortable. Really, really like them. And they were 27.99. This is the upper wash I got and it looks a bit darker on camera than it seems in real life but they're a kind of washed dark grey black so it's as if they were black jeans that have been washed loads but then on the actual rips you've got the black detailing through the stitching which is quite nice. It's a good contrast between the colour of the jeans and then the actual rips. Again the sort of cut off whoop bottoms as well which looks really good and they just fit really lovely. I like the pockets on the back and they make your bum look nice which is always good. Here they are on. I was a bit funny about this wash at the beginning. I wasn't quite sure whether I'd get a lot of wear out of them but actually I'm really enjoying it the more I look at it and these were £27.99 as well. Next up, not very exciting and I've just realised they're not done up for me trying them on, is just a pair of work trousers because I really struggle to find work trousers that 
look nice and are comfy and fit well because when you're in them all day at a desk they need to be comfy so these seemed really good they are the slim leg 15.99 trousers there's no very description on them and yeah they've got a little gold detailing on the front there they've got a button and a claspy thing so that's always good and not much else to say about work trousers really the waist is quite um sort of fitted but then the actual trousers themselves have a bit of stretch in them which is good and here they are on i tend to wear work trousers maybe two times a week and then like dresses or a skirt the other two days so i'll be getting a lot of wear out of them and like i said they were 15.99 i also picked up this leopard print scarf which is lovely oops lovely and soft and quite a big one yeah it's more like a sort of blanket scarf which will be really nice and cozy all wrapped up i have a coat that's a sort of oatmeal color that i think this will look really lovely with and it was 12.99 and then i picked up two pairs of boots i cannot for the life of me find where all my heeled boots have gone i had like two or three pairs of black heeled boots like this sort of everyday size heel can't find them anywhere i'm not quite sure what i've done with them so ended up picking up these ones these were in the sales so they were only 14 pounds down from 30 and i love them i'm not always one for pointed boots because i think they make my feet look a bit funny but these are really nice they're really flattering and really like the detailing on the side there with the nice silver zip and then this little ring detail lovely size heel and very very comfortable so I think I'll be able to wear these to work, wear them out, all sorts. The only thing is, is that they were in the sale and they were the only pair left and they're in wide fit and I don't have very wide feet. I have quite narrow feet. So I think I'll have to wear some big socks for them, but they're very comfy and I really like them. And then another pair of boots, unfortunately this time not in the sale. So they were 29.99. I just realized they've still got the this on them. Oh, from obviously when they got delivered. And yeah, they're really nice. They're kind of like that suede type material. More ring detailing, this time in gold, but really pale gold, which is lovely. The zips are on the inside rather than on the outside. And lovely little heels. Nice that the heels are the same color as the boot as well. I quite like that. I think that looks nice. And yeah, really, really like them. And the last thing is this coat. I'll sit back a bit, which I was umming and eyeing about for ages. I needed a coat like this for going to Isla's football and being outside, especially with the way the weather is just now. So. What drew me to this was actually the colour of it. I've not seen too many of these proper puffer coats that aren't navy or black, or mustard seems to be the colour this year. But this pale grey is lovely. The things that kind of stopped me from buying it, I was there for ages trying to decide, so I'm still not 100%, I do like it, but there is a possibility I might take it back, is that, and it sounds really silly, it makes me out to be such a mum, but the hood comes down really far. So like, if you are out in the rain or whatever else, even though I don't know how waterproof this would actually be, um, it comes down really far so it's a bit like so that was one thing and then the other thing was the belt isn't actually um that tight it seems like they've used the same size belt for all the different sizes so yeah but i do like it i'll show you it on and it's just a really cozy little puffer coat here it is on i'm really really enjoying the color i do really like it and it fits lovely i had to get a size smaller than i usually would but because they just didn't have my size but it seems to be all right I just need to decide whether I'm keeping it or not or whether I'm going to find a different one. But it was $54.99. Thank you so much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed this. Give me a comment below letting me know what your favourite bit was and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye!